Hi guys, uh, I'm very excited to share with you the first SCOMI International team update. My name is Steintje and I'm the SCOMI director and we want to use this update to tell you a bit more about the things that we've worked on and the things you can expect from us for the rest of the year. Uh, so we started our term uh, by getting to know how things work and hand over. Agostinho, the liaison officer, and me uh, already went to the team of officials meeting where we got to know the rest of the team of officials, set out some groundwork on uh, what we want to achieve by this year. Um, and we also used the beginning of the term to select uh, a group of very excited and very highly motivated comedians who will be part of your international team. Um, and hopefully uh, they will share a lot of their knowledge and materials with you as well. Uh, the first thing that you really need to know is you can always approach us at any time. Whether you want help, uh, how to establish a new project, whether you want to know what international meetings you can attend. Um, anything you ever need, uh, contact either the regional assistant or either Agostinho and me. Um, we have Russia for uh, Africa, Scott for the Americas, uh, Yamin for Asia Pacific, Ahmad for the EMR, and Rachel for Europe. And they're here to help you as an NMO as well. Um, we also send out a survey, uh, which a lot of you filled in. Many thanks for that, uh, which will help you help us to define our priorities for this year and what you guys expect from us. So thank you very much. Um, one of the things we want to do differently for this year, uh, we wanted to set up a few priorities for the international team. This is both to uh, give you a chance to actually work on the international level and contribute, as well as for us to make sure that things actually get done. Um, we divide it into five groups, non-formal education, which will be uh, led by Ahmad, uh, curriculum and projects database which will be worked on by Rachel and we already made a lot of progress here together with the other standing comedy directors uh, the project support division director and new technologies um, so we're very happy to might be able to give you a lot of updates on that soon uh, student health and rights will be worked on by Scott sexual uh, and reproductive health education will be worked on by Rasha and internal working, so for example, manuals for within SCOMI uh, will be worked on by Yamin. Uh, we already lost, uh, discussed a lot of these subjects together with other team of officials members, for example, and we all seem very excited um, to actually work on these. Uh, so we're now we're just going to figure out the last few details and then hopefully we can send out uh, some calls to you guys so please feel engaged and feel that you can actually contribute to these working groups and uh, please join us there. Hi everyone my name is Agustin Souza and I'm starting my second term as a liaison officer for medical education issues and it is with great pleasure that I'm sending this message to you and the goal of this small presentation is to explain in a little bit of the things that I will do this year as you may know, SCOMI is starting a lot of projects this year, internal projects from the international team, projects such as talking about students' health, our health, talking about medical students' rights, talking about the problem of accreditation of medical schools. And my role on the international team is to pick up those discussions that we have in the international team in the SCOMI servers, a discussion between medical students and talk with externals, make that connection with externals related to medical education. And in the next few months, we'll, we'll also do a lot of activities during the regional meetings and the general assemblies, uh, such as the essential skills for, on medical education for students. And my role on, on those trainings is to prepare those trainings and also contact externals so we can have better sessions because they can share their experience with us. So by now, I think it's everything, it's just a little bit of the things that we'll do this year. But if you have interest in any other information, please contact me. I, I will gladly reply to your emails or to your messages or having a chat with you. So please contact me and I hope to see you soon. 
everyone, I'm Ahmad Badr and I'm your regional assistant for the Eastern Mediterranean region for this year for SCOMI. So in the past few weeks I've been trying to uh, get the database for all the NOMIs and so far I've been successful to get all the updated emails for most of you and I sent you an email personally so check your inbox, you'll find it there. Uh, also our awesome SCOMI director Steincha has made a survey to collect your opinions about what our priorities be should be for, the, for this term and what our international team should work on. So uh, please find it in your inbox, please fill it out so that we can that can help us uh, find our priorities for this term. What will, we do, what will we be doing the next few weeks? We'll be having our first online meeting for the region. And I'll be sending you an email so that we can find the best date and time for most of you to be there. So keep checking your inbox uh, so that we can have our first awesome online meeting. And our international team is really amazing this year. So if you ever need any help from uh, any one of us, please feel free to contact us at any time. And I hope to see you soon, first in the online meeting and then in the physical meeting in Kuwait. See you soon. Bye-bye. Hello, I'm Jose. I'm Yamin from Bangladesh, 14 medical student. I'm working as co-medical assistant for Asian Pacific region in the start. And I'm also working as national officer of medical education in the United And previously, I've also worked in the same post. And I've conducted the school uh, session in the regional meeting. And what I have experienced from the meeting is that uh, there is a noticeable difference in discrimination within the medical education systems and curriculums in the countries of this region. And not only that, there is a huge uh, lack of representations of medical, medical students in the medical education system. So what I have planned for my next term is to build up an FTC program uh, on student representation region and not, not only that to support the uh, national member organizations in this region to build up sustainable school projects uh, with the national boundaries or transnational projects and also internationally to build up SCOMI as a platform of uh, students forum or discussions on medical education issues so that so that they can uh, gather and share the medical education resources the ideas on uh, policy statements in medical education within the IFMSA. So, in short, this is the brief from me as major assistant, and hope to see you and uh, work with you guys in the future. Thank you. Hi again. Uh, thanks for watching all the updates. There's still one group of people I would like to introduce you to, and those are the transnational project coordinators. In SCOMI, we have several projects that are running uh, through multiple countries and are being coordinated internationally. And these coordinators are here to help you as well. So if you have any interest in setting up Dying a Human Thing, Good Medical Practice, WHO Simulations, or Breaking the Silence, please feel free the, to write them a message. And also, if you have a lot of experience in either one of these projects, maybe you can help other NMOs as well. So uh, please contact them uh, in that case also. Um, now, the last thing I wanted to tell you was the things that are on the agenda now for the next month. Uh, we'll be mainly focusing on the African Regional Meeting and the Americas Regional Meeting. They're both coming up really soon, and I'll, I hope to see many of you at any, any one of those. Um, in Panama, we also set up a workshop, Essential Skills in Medical Education for Students, uh, and both Agostinho and I will be there. Um, so if you want to come, please apply before November 8th. You'll learn a lot about student representation, uh, how medical education works, and medical education systems. Even if you're not from SCOMI, um, this workshop will be very useful to you as well. Um, and in this month, you'll also hopefully receive a lot of calls for priority topics, which I mentioned before. Um, and it's time to start up the regional online meetings again. So there's a lot of opportunities for you to get in contact with us. Um, please use them and please feel free to give us feedback at any time. So many thanks uh, for listening to our update. Many hugs and uh, we'll talk to you soon, hopefully. Bye.